I have not yet met a girl who said to me, I love this, I love what I do. They do it because they are trapped. They're trapped between two men most of the time. The one guy sells her and the other one buys her. And she will please both of them because she needs her reward at the end of the day, which is not currency, hard cash, but currency, the currency is drugs. And that's what's so sad. She really gets nothing from this deal. She only survives for another day. And her body gets sicker and sicker. I did what her and Addie does the best, is I adapted to survive. So I would make my pimp happy, because if he's happy, I'm happy. If I've got drugs, I'm happy, then he's happy. And the dealers, the, the, the client's happy, and then I'm happy, and I've got money, and I can make him happy. So it's a circle of evil. Even the daily routine was an evil circle. It's like, you wake up, you smoke, you eat, you, have, you go to the street, you have sex with men, different, different men. I was telling the Uber driver, how this COVID thing, you know, everyone sees it as a bad thing, and I agree. But what we don't see is that um, in some areas it, it has improved places like the streets. You know, a lot of the girls had to go home, and so the streets were empty, which in a way is good because they couldn't work, um, they couldn't sell themselves and get more trauma. Maybe we definitely got it wrong by making men feel like they must do so much, because women can do everything without men for the most part. Learn how to love, <laughs> even when it's difficult to love. But I learned how to love and I found Jesus here also. I never really knew him and he was there all the time. At the age of 14 years, I started being naughty, sleeping around, going to the clubs, drinking alcohol, because um, I felt rejected, I felt lonely, I didn't belong. So I looked for love in the wrong places. I've been here. For well, four years, I'm clean. I've never been back to the street. Um, my journey has been in this home. I feel loved, I feel belong here. Yeah. And this is my family, it's my safe place. The SEC and I'll start there. You guys already know your gifts. Your t-shirts are there and I also got you guys a little chocolate and a message inside the chocolate just to thank you guys and to give you a bit of word of encouragement. And that we are very much happy to be here and thank you for opening up this home to us.